there and do the same exact thing that we have the confidence in him that he'll go out there and do the same exact things that make the same plays that Darren's made because he plays inside the system and he uh, and he just knows what he's doing. What is it like when you play next to Darren, the way he's playing right now and from last year? What stands out to you about him? Uh, you know, Darren's he's out there, he's confident as well. So you can just look in the guy's eyes, look at him him and Joshua's eyes and just know that they're confident in me. Uh, playing beside two all American type linebackers is is amazing because just watching them make plays and it's making me want to play up to their standards and play up to the Silver Bullet standards and Derek, the guys that played before us. Darren keeps referring to it as y'all are having fun out there. I mean you, you wish you could almost play defense all day. <laughs> uh, I'm I'm sure you don't, but I mean but what, what is it like out there right now, Raekwon, with the way things are going? I mean, we got the mindset that if we have to win the game three to zero, then that's just how we're going to win the game. Uh, we can't we can't depend on anybody else. We just got to go out there and stop their offense and do our job, and then everything else take care of itself. Do you consider yourself an honorary member of the front four right now? The way they keep throwing you up there on the line occasionally on some of those sets, and you're standing on the edge. I mean. Uh, I mean, do you, do you, when they present those game plans every week, do you get excited about what you see? I mean, what, what do you, you know what I mean? Uh, what do you think about the plans that you're getting right now? You know, I, I know that Coach Figgs is going to put me in the best situation possible to make plays uh, for our defense. But, you know, I feel like I'm a part of the guys. Because every time I come in, uh, Dolphins, Joey, Tommy, Taekwondo, they always show love to me when I'm on the line. So, that's fine. <laughs> you mentioned that. You mentioned. I'm sure with as well as things are going for the defense, there are still things that you hope to improve on. What, what are those things right now? Because they're pretty hard for us to identify. Hey, you know, there's always room for improvement in everything I do. Just, uh, you know, Coach Fick just got on us about crossing over inside the box. Just little small stuff like that. It's the little things that make the most impact on your game. Uh, crossing over inside the box, uh, our alignments, being precise in our alignments, uh, getting the guys in front of us in line, making those adjustments and knowing what the back end is doing behind it, just small stuff like that. You, you said earlier when the front four has been great when you kind of get the guys set up where they're supposed to be, and you just kind of mentioned it again there. And the middle linebacker is supposed to be the quarterback of the of the defense, so to speak. Uh, how how do you think you're coming along in that role? Do you feel comfortable even as a, a second-year sophomore kind of being directing traffic in there? You know, last year I wasn't real confident on setting the front and then knowing what the back end is doing behind me. But, uh, you know, with the help of Josh and Darren and even Vaughn and Tyvis, you know, those are the guys that I really work with on the play-by-play. Uh, play. Just setting the front, knowing what the front is doing behind, in front of me, and uh, whatever set the offense comes out of, Vaughn is always yelling at the coverage behind me, so he always helps me out, and I'm more confident with what I'm doing so I can play a lot faster. When you, uh, you mentioned